Good morning. I'd like to share with you from Psalm 132 today. Now, this isn't like the others that we've had. This is one of the Psalms of Ascents, but there's 18 verses here, so we're not going to read it all. But if you have your Bible and you take this and look it up, I think you'll find it to be uh, an engaging psalm. This is about David and the sanctuary, and he's determined that he will uh, take and make there to be a resting place for the uh, ark of God, the sanctuary, bring it to where it needs to be. And of course, David didn't build the sanctuary later, his son Solomon did. But this is about um, that thing that David said, I will, I will, I will not rest until I've created a place, uh, that place that God wants there to be. And then God comes back and in a covenant way, he's, he says, I'll be faithful to the uh, sons of David. And as we come up here to uh, verse 11 and 12, the Lord has sworn in truth to David, he will not turn from it. I will set upon your throne the fruit of your body. If your sons will keep my covenant and my testimony, which I shall teach them, their sons shall sit upon your throne forevermore. And then we have this. Uh, the Lord has chosen Zion. He has desired it for his dwelling place. This is my resting place forever. Here I will dwell, for I have desired it. I will abundantly bless her provision. I will satisfy her poor with bread. I will clothe her priests with salvation, and her saints shall shout aloud for joy, and so on. So this is uh, God coming to his people and dwelling with them. You know, they've been uh, down to Egypt and, and had troubles, been to Babylon, but God uh, gathers them. And that's his ultimate plan for us is to gather them into his kingdom. So Psalm 132 has got a lot of pieces here, but um, we want to be forthright and determined as David was. And God, of course, is, is more than equally determined to be faithful to us. So we have some promises here that God will come through. Uh, we need to work and we want to work with his plan. So Psalm 132, one of the Psalms of Ascent. Let me pray with you. Dear Father in heaven, we want that uh, we will be on your side. We want that we will be in a covenant commitment with you. And so help us to be faithful. Uh, here's an example of you being very ready to be faithful with your servant David and, and Jesus, of course, being ultimately the king on the throne of David. So uh, you are faithful, and so help us, Lord, to be faithful too, not in our strength, but in your strength. Please bless us today. Give us some stability in our Christian walk in a time with crazy stuff. Thank you for hearing our prayer. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, the Lord be with you today throughout your day and give you the strength and courage and the wisdom you need for just this day. Don't worry about tomorrow, just for this day. He'll give you what you need. God be with you.